Top Kent 100. You already know it's the real field TV that you tuned into. Now, 32 Fur TV did an interview with CMG artist Big Boogie. You already know how he giving it up, man. He doing classy interviews over there. Now, you know I'm a community tab, and I'm going to put the link below. Now, you already know if I stamp them, then they talking about something for real. To all my haters, the snow bunny you're currently dating resembles an Afghan hound. Hand and hold some scissors. Why do you keep bringing her to cookouts? It's confusing and scaring everybody. And your little brother's in the front yard rumbling right now, and he's losing. So I don't know what you're doing right now, nigga. Nigga, on, nigga, on. And listen to Hot Rod albums, nigga. Currently with G-Unit. We don't know him no more. Now, want to talk about Pooh Shiesty, man. And we really want to get into this situation like it's supposed to be with Pooh Shiesty. And we really want to talk about what everybody else is insinuating, man. Because at the same time, man, we don't really care about this situation, man. Because as it looks right now, niggas is sitting up here saying anything and doing anything, bro. And right now, it's crazy because it's like they weren't about NBA young boy, baby mother, and what she doing when we already know that... Pooh Shiesty was recently in a situation where some, you know what I'm saying, Tran tried to come and tried to do this and that and tried to say it was this artist and that artist of 1017, trying to basically, you know, smear his image. And this happens to plenty of artists, but we want to get back to NBA Youngboy, baby mother. Here's what y'all got to realize. Females is going to do what they're going to do. And that's just real talk. You cannot make NBA Youngboy look bad. Uh, can't no female make him look bad. Uh, neither can Pooh Shiesty by saying that he was even in her inbox. Now, because Pooh Shiesty deals with Lil Dirt, we already know that it can't be nothing between NBA Youngboy and Pooh Shiesty, but NBA Youngboy was a fan of Lil Dirt, bro. You know what I mean? The record show. You see what I'm saying? So it could have been unity, but the thing is, everybody got off on the wrong foot and it was miscommunication. So it's like with Pooh Shiesty and NBA Youngboy Baby Mother with him saying that she tried to get inside his DM and then erasing the comment and all that. I don't think that this make him look no type of way. You see what I'm saying? And I'm speaking of NBA young boy. I'm just saying females do this. Won't she in the Bane Man um DM, Jay the Young in um DM? Now when he this baby Joe, he explained what he with baby um not baby yeah, when he was in the baby Joe video that he did to him, he explained what NBA young boy baby mother was like and all that and what she was about. So this ain't no situation where Pooh Shiesty or nobody, you know, with him saying what he said, he was probably out of pocket. But I don't think it's no situation where him or NBA young boy look bad in this situation. Females going to do what they going to do, bro. You can have a baby mother and whatever the case may be, and you can't control what she do. And that's why a lot of you youngsters got to stop going to jail behind these females, you know what I'm saying, because y'all tender. You see what I'm saying? That's real talk. Because when you realize that you don't own these females' private parts, you know what I'm saying, then life will go a lot easier. Because... You know, if you're not doing your job, others going to rise to the occasion. You see what I'm saying? If you have a baby by a female, you don't plan on being with her for life, then and you're going to feel some type of way about her being in niggas' DMs and all that, then you shouldn't have never got a pregnant in the first place. This is why you got to think about what you do. And I know a lot of niggas don't want to hear that. It sounds like I'm preaching all the time. But this is the real feel TV. I got to give you that real feel. You see what I'm saying? And that's real. Because a lot of people keep on talking about, well, Pooh Shiesty was wrong for even saying that. How? I mean, it is what it is. These females try to expose niggas all day in the DM. And I'm not getting on, you know what I mean, the females and trying to, you know, square them out. I'm just saying it happens. So when a dude do it, it just happened. You see what I'm saying? Neither is right. Neither. You know? So that's just what I'm trying to explain. So y'all got to let me know what's going on because a lot of people feel like NBA young boy is just like some type of dude where he can control all his baby mothers. And Pooh Shiesty is one of the hottest dudes right now. You know, females going for what's hot. You know, they not really going for, you know, nobody's, you know, actual lyricism or what they bring to the table. You know what I'm saying? They going for the glamour and the glitz, man. Some baby mothers like that in the hood. They go for all the hood stars and all the street stars. Don't give a damn about the regular nigga working at 9 to 5. I'm just saying, bro. You know what I'm saying? 
Now, with that being said, y'all drop them comments, man. And y'all let me know how y'all feel. I just feel like ain't nobody looking bad in this situation other than Pooh Shiesty kissing and telling. Not to say that he did nothing with her, but you know what I'm saying? He didn't even really have to broadcast that. But other than that, this don't make NBA look bad on him. I'm gone.